Good day. The state television company of Western Armenia represents all the most important events of these days. Today's broadcast, President of Western Armenia Armena Kabraman presented an extensive folder to UN. Vandalism been Hadrut, Azerbaijan's removed the cross of Spitak Hutch Church. Erdogan's agenda includes the borders of outlined by the national agreement. The deported people from Artsakh had a protest and handed a letter to the Minister of Foreign Affairs. A spring in memory of Armenian artist Arshil Gorgi was destroyed in one province of Western Armenia. Being a people preparing decorations, we don't have a single catalog book to present to the world, Hamlet of Sepian. I have sent to UN an 800-page folder on agreements, treaties and other constructive arrangements between indigenous people and states, which also includes peace agreements, reconciliation initiatives and their constitutional recognition. I want to inform you that I have received response from a UN to the approval of the folder, regardless of anything the struggle for the protection of the rights of Western Armenia and the indigenous Armenian people continues. Speech by the President of Western Armenia, Armena Gabraman. Azerbaijan constantly continues the policy of destroying the cultural heritage and Armenian traces in occupied territories of the Republic of Artsakh. For example, the Spitak Hutch Church of the village of Fang in Hadrut region has been added to the example of cultural genocide carried out by Azerbaijan in the occupied territories of Artsakh since the end of 2020. From the video material distributed in Azerbaijan a part of social network, it becomes clear that Azerbaijan has removed the cross from the church. Moreover, under the pretext of construction of the temple, in addition to the cross, the Azerbaijan side demolished the roof of the church. In early November 2021, Azerbaijan presented the church as a monument of Albanian Udi culture, which has nothing to do with reality. In 1920, a closed session held on January 28th, the deputies of Ottoman Parliament adopted a national agreement, which is presented to the public on February 17th. The eight-point document is considered a political declaration of Kemalist nationalist movement, which defined the territories and borders belonging to Turkey. According to this document, Turkey's border includes Western Thrace, Cyprus, Aegean Islands, Violets of the former Mosul of Aleppo, and other places. On various maps relating to borders of national agreement, Ajara and Nakh Nakhichevan are also part of Turkey. The article is fully available on our official website. The displaced people of Artsakh had a protest in front of government building, during which a number of questions related to their status were asked in interview with journalists. One of the participants of the action expressed the voice of the protest this way. The Republic of Armenia continues its criminal indifference, continues not to recognize refugee status, and turns out that an Armenian in this history does not feel that he is an Armenian. Once a meeting was held at a UN office on the issue of the refugee status, people responded shapely to us. If your government does not recognize your status, how will we recognize it? These people from Artsakh marched to the building of Ministry of Foreign Affairs to deliver a letter to Minister Ararat Mirzorian on granting refugee status. The monument of famous Armenian artist Arshil Gorgi, Manuk Vostani Kadoyan, burned in one in Western Armenia, has been destroyed. The source was restored and launched in 2015. Among their residents, it is known as the source of Gorgi. A sign in Armenian, Kurdish, English and Turkish is posted in the territory of the source. First, the cranes were broken, then a part of which Gorgi's name was written was damaged. In the end, the sign of Arshil Gorgi, with a biography written in four languages, was also removed and destroyed. The local authorities declared that they are not aware of the destruction of the source. The world famous artist Ashil Gorgi was born in Dikaya Quarter, Artemis province, and having lived there during the genocide of Armenian people in 1950, later settled in the United States. Hamlet of Sepan, a collector of Armenian art and other unique samples, wrote on his Facebook page, How many lives did this ornament save during the genocide of Armenian people? Yes, I agree. If our grandfathers have realized the effect of time and turned this ornament into ballots, they would undoubtedly have lived in a different Armenia and a much larger number of compatriots today. Many Armenians can save themselves by giving their jewelry to courts, visits to museums in various cities of Western Armenia and a history of my ancestors mainly inspired me to took for Armenian jewelry and other objects to return them to my roots. Armenian civil smiths, carpet weaves, embroiders, porters, operating in different regions of Western Armenia, their work of miniatures and other masters are unfairly attributed to Turks, Kurds, Arabs, Iranians, Russians, Balkan countries and other people today, but never to Armenians. Now the musical part, Armenian folk song, Gna Ari, Man Ari.
The full version of this video is available on Western Armenia's YouTube channel. This was all for today. Goodbye.